Hey, how's it going everyone? Michael back with another video. In this video, I'm going to show you how to switch to the classic designer in Power Automate. If you enjoy Power Automate, Power Apps, SharePoint, and Teams videos, feel free to subscribe because I'll be putting out more videos in those areas. Now for my intro. So recently there was sort of a big update to Power Automate, I feel like. There's now a co-pilot automation that helps you create flows i haven't really done too much with that yet because i when i create flows i pretty much know how to create them i don't really need any assistance i know how to get to from point a to point b so that's new and they also updated the user interface so when i go to create a new flow let will just go ahead and click something randomly as you can see we now have the co-pilot on the right hand side but besides that, we have this grid-like view. And I think this change is good, but if you're an old user that's been using Power Automate for years, it's like it's gonna take you some time to embrace the change. And I'm still learning the grid view. Um, I'm still getting used to having all the things on the left-hand side. But if you wanna go ahead and switch to the classic designer for Power Automate, in the top right-hand corner, we have a triple dot uh, when you hover over it says more commands you want to go ahead and click on switch to classic designer and this will actually take you to the classic designer so if i go ahead and go to one of my older flows let's go ahead and click on multi-person field email i'm not sure what this does but it automatically brings me oh maybe not so maybe when you click on switch to classic designer it will set that to like your default but i'm sure it'll switch back to uh, the new designer. I'll soon learn how to do this change uh, using the grid view and everything. I'll put out more videos about it. But if you still still want to do the old way, uh, the triple dot in the right hand corner is uh, how do you switch it to the classic designer. The more you get comfortable doing it this way, uh, just go ahead and check out the new designer and uh, try to decipher it. So that'll be the video for today. I just want to put out this quick little video about the uh, the power automate update if you enjoy the video or have any comments please leave them down below and i will catch you guys in the next video